Hi, I'm Maria Bartholdi, and I'm here to talk about how to demo Dungeons & Dragons using the Voyage to Stormwreck Isle encounter. To potential players, Dungeons & Dragons rules can seem intimidating, but with an engaging and fun demo, anyone can get started on a journey to become a lifelong player and fan. I've got the three keys to running an incredible Dungeons & Dragons demo. Let's dig in. Make sure everyone at your table has a chance to shine, getting your full attention, focus, and help when needed. Different players bring different expectations and interests to the game. Some will want to dive into role-playing, others will focus on the rules, and some may mostly watch. Help any players who may be getting stuck by offering suggestions or simple choices. Dungeons & Dragons is for everyone. When running a demo or introducing the game, make space at your table for all types of players and be sure to involve everyone. Learning the rules of Dungeons & Dragons takes time, so start by focusing on just one, rolling a d20 and adding a modifier. This rule governs ability checks, attack rolls, and saving throws, putting it at the core of the Dungeons & Dragons system. Rather than explain the other rules, you can address them as needed. To get started with a new group, you only need to do the following. Briefly introduce Dungeons & Dragons. It's a collaborative storytelling game where you work together as a team. Help players pick a character. Don't focus on the mechanics. Instead, lean on popular fantasy archetypes. Explain rolling a d20. You roll the die and add a modifier. And start the encounter by setting the scene. With that, you're off. Lean into what your players are enjoying. Above all else, Dungeons & Dragons means fun. A short encounter makes an ideal demo. Make sure to involve all of your players, explain rolling a d20, and put the fun first. Perfect for accomplishing these goals is the short demo Voyage to Stormwreck Isle, a short prelude to the new D&D starter set adventure, Dragons of Stormwreck Isle. The demo takes between 15 and 30 minutes to run, depending on the group. Learn to Play D&D Weekend runs October 7th to 9th, but you can always use this demo in your store to introduce D&D. Based on what region you're in, you'll receive a combination of a marketing kit and materials to support the release of Dragons of Stormwreck Isle. Kits include one double-sided event poster, one organizer instruction sheet, two sets of demo encounter cards, two sets of Dungeon Master instructions, two sets of five ready-to-play characters, 20 new player next steps handouts, and 20 dice pouches for Wizards account users. With a Wizards account, players can access the digital tools of D&D Beyond. Be sure to only hand out the dice pouches to players who join your events using a Wizards account. The short demo Voyage to Stormwreck Isle continues in Drowned Sailors, a 60 to 90 minute adventure session. For players eager for more, you can run Drowned Sailors during Learn to Play weekend or at a later date. So what's next? These two demo experiences lead into Dragons of Stormwreck Isle adventure play. Following along the adventure inside the newly released Dragons of Stormwreck Isle, this weekly play in your shop runs from October 10th to November 20th. It's a continuation of the demo experience, bringing players back in week after week. You'll receive an email from Wizards of the Coast with details on how to best split the adventure in the book into four two-hour sessions, but you can make additional adjustments as you see fit. You're now ready for the release of Dragons of Stormwreck Isle, Learn to Play D&D Weekend, and how to host incredible Dungeons & Dragons demos. Be sure to schedule your events in Wizards event link. Play begins on October 7th.